morning. My name is Peter Dickey. I'm President and CEO of Quantum Rare Earth Developments Corp. We are developing a large niobium deposit in the state of Nebraska with a current resource estimate in excess of half a billion kilograms of niobium. This is one of the largest undeveloped niobium resources in the world and we're about to release an updated resource estimate that will increase the size of the known deposit. I invite you to stay tuned to learn more about this exciting project. Hello, my name is Richard Wolanski. I've just come from hearing uh, Peter Dickey from Quantum Rare Earths um, speak about his Niobium project. Um, the speech was uh, very educational. One of the issues that we have uh, in a strategic metals uh, um, environment like this is um, the requirement that the speech be both educational and uh, entertaining and provide uh, good insight into the opportunity for the company. I think Peter's speech did that uh, both and I, I've got a great insight into the Niobe market and just how well placed uh, Quantum Rare OS are to take advantage of that. Thank you very much uh, and uh, great thanks to the hosts here. They've uh, provided a wide variety of commodities for us to look at here and I think I'm the first one talking about Niobium and hopefully the only one. <clears throat> uh, our company is called Quantum Rare Earth Developments. Quick show of hands here, I'm assuming everybody knows what the rare earth elements are, right down to a T. Now does everybody in the room also know that niobium is not a rare earth? Got a few hands there, that's great. So I actually, uh, sadly I got an email from a mining engineer uh, I'm located in Canada, of course, and uh, I received an email from a mining engineer last fall who's based in the U.S., and his question was why he couldn't find niobium under the rare earth portion of the periodic table. So after a week of mulling over my answer, I replied, because it isn't. <laughs> 